Welcome back programmers. In the today's section we are gonna create arcade games using python. So basically if you ever play arcade games like Mario, Contra or Ninja Turtles my favorite. So python has a package arcade. So with the use of arcade you can create arcade games or some people say arcade games I don't know but the spelling is import arcade games only the arcade so if you want to install this in your command promote so just install pip install arcade so with the use of this command we can import the arcade when i run this program you can see process finished with exit code 0 now let's create a arcade game now before start to learn arcade games first you need to remember the tkinter now if you don't know tkinter or if you want to learn tkinter check out my previous video tkinter is a gui application for python we can create a gui application using python tkinter so this is same like the tkinter first we are gonna create a window to create a game and for that we have function arcade dot open window and in here first parameter is you can see the first parameter is height second is width and the third is windows title now let's add the windows height so the height is let's say 500 or into 500 and the windows title name is my game and we just created a window to create a game now we have to create a loop or you can say we have to create a infinite loop to run these windows when i run this program you can see the windows is opened just for 0 0.01 second so you we have to create a loop and for that we have a function arcade dot run now let's open this windows you can see we got a windows and it says my game this is our title my game and we got a uh, three function minimize maximize and close maximize is hidden because we have to do something for that now let's just close this now let's create an emoji first create let's draw something on our windows so we can see how to draw something how to fill the color now the windows is white but what if you want to change the color this is not white color this is just plain windows it has no color we can see white because it is plain so let's put the color on our windows so we have a function obviously arcade dot set background color and the parameter is obviously color so the color is arcade we have function arcade dot color now arcade dot color is a lot of package or you can say function when i click arcade dot color dot you can see we got a lots of color in here so we are gonna use for now let's just choose any randomly color now let's run this code okay so it's filled with cadet gray let's change the color so we just created a set background color equal to yellow what you can see the yellow yes you can see i can see either because we have to render these windows now how to render these windows and how to draw something in these windows so we can see the background color or something draw in our windows and for that we are gonna render these windows or you can say render this program so and for that we are gonna go in here and type arcade obviously start render and if we start render we have to close the re render 
and for that we have function arcade dot finish render now in the between of start and finish we are gonna draw something and create something but first let's see the windows and now you can see the background color is yellow because we start render and finished render without this you can't see shit okay now that we created a uh, windows now let's create a circle but first i'm gonna change the color because i don't like yellow color so i'm gonna change the color into blue and now let's change the i okay i changed the color now let's create a circle obviously for circle we are gonna use arcade we got inbuilt function just use that core term function draw circle you can see we got draw circle field if you are good programmer so obviously you are using pycharm name if you are using pycharm so just move your arrow in the bracket or you can say tuple and you can see the parameter you have to pass in this function so obviously the first parameter is x and second is y and third is radius and the fourth is what color you want to field in this circle let's add this let's just add a 300 and 300 and 200 so x is 300 2 y is 300 and obviously your radius is 200 now let's add the color like in here you can see arcade.color.blue we are gonna use arcade.color we are creating an emoji right so the emoji color is obviously yellow so let's just use uh, oh, oh, oops yellow now let's run this program and boom you can see the yellow circle and the blue screen i don't like blue screen i'm gonna change it into white and obviously i'm gonna change the width and height of the window so i just change the window height and width into 600 and background color is white now let's run this program and boom you can see the circle between in the center of the windows now let's create i okay now that we created our circle and yellow now let's just create uh, two eyes and for eyes we are gonna simply create two circle okay so this is our circle body i'm gonna copy this code and i'm gonna create eye from this I'm gonna just change the width and height and the radius I'm gonna copy this code again and I'm gonna name it i2 okay so I just change the i1 and i2 circle x and y and radius of circle now what exactly is x and y so let's say this is our windows and in this window we are gonna create a emoji so you can see this is our y and this is our x so if you want to create a circle in here so you can see in here in the pixel x and y position so that's how you can choose the position if you are using paint so you can see in here pixel and x and y so that's how you can find the x and y like if you want to create a circle in here so you can see the x and y this is our y and this is our x and that's how i just create a two circle first one is 370 and the second one is 230 and this is 350 and 350 and the radius is 20 because i is small and now i'm gonna just change the eye color into black so you can see the eye color is now black now let's run this code and you can see the eyes in our face this is eyes and 
that's how you can create eyes in our emoji now let's create mouth of our emoji and for that we are gonna simply just create a line and for that we have inbuilt function arcade dot arc draw arc outline and in this function we have to pass few arguments first one is obviously x and the last one is sorry the second one is y and the last one is color now you can see there is a seven parameter you have to pass but first let's just enter x and y the important is three just let's add a randomly 372 302 350 and I'm gonna choose color is black now let's run this code and you can see missing for required positional argument so the we have to add a width and a height of the line so let's just add width is 120 and 100 and then in here you can see start angle and end angle we have to pass the parameter let's add you can see we got a line but this is so tiny line this is like a uh, so little and height and width is so low so let's just change this okay in here i just used the draw smile x equal to 300 y equal to 218 width equal to 120 height equal to 100 start angle equal to 119 and end angle equal to 350 okay and i just pass the parameter as a variable you can see in here x y width height arcade dot color dot black start angle and end angle and in here i just pass the tenth y tenth let's just first run the code you can see we got a smile in here this is kind of weird and without 10 you can see the line is so thin very very thin now let's just add a smile you can add any of number in here let's just add 10 sorry 20 and you can see the line is kind of fat in here okay the 10 is good okay we just created a smiley face in here but the smile is kind of weird because if the smile is start in here and end in here so it's look good let's change this and now you can see the smile is good because I changed the width and the height of this outline so now you can see the emoji is like perfect and that's how you can create a emoji in with the use of arcade and in the next video we are gonna create a game like this you can see we can move the player and we are gonna create a uh, levels and I don't know what is this this is a mountain or something i don't know we are gonna create like this so that is it for today guys in the next video we are gonna create a tree and a player and a bonus coin so that is it for today's guys the code of this video is in the description check out and if you like this video share this video like subscribe to channel thank you